Hello everyone! I'm Natasha Brianne Ramon and this is my vlog! You wanna vlog? Huh? <laughs> so yeah, hi! Um, well, hello everyone! So yeah, hi! Sorry about that. So yeah, I'm here tonight to talk about my looping stroller! Yes! Now actually it's not the best time to talk about strollers given that kids really can't travel nowadays or it's not a priority for travel right now. But I would like to share with you this stroller of mine which my parents bought or actually my parents bought it but it was given as a gift by my Kong Kong and Mama Rods last 2019 even before i was born so they bought this at a baby fair at the sm baby fair january of 2019 it was on sale and i am going out of the balcony now yes so it was on sale the original price is 18000 but during but, but during the fair it was down to 13000 and it was on sale with the car seat the newborn car seat which you can attach to the stroller and for, so basically all in all it's srp was twenty six thousand, but okay there you go but my parents was able to buy it at nineteen thousand two hundred, so that was a 26 percent discount anyway we are happy, very much happy with the stroller and just recently, it was on hiatus for quite some time because pandemic, so, but recently, they got it out of its hiding spot. Asha, come here. <laughs> and now, when we stroll around the village, uh, the neighborhood, I use it and I love it actually. So yeah, I love it. And what actually made my mommy think about using this again for me is my Ninong Kyle bought this same type of stroller at a very, very, very cheap price or very, very, very low price of 6000 in Lazada a few days back. It was on sale, but the unit that they're selling at 6000 for the looping squeeze 2 is a demo unit but upon checking the reviews from previous buyers it's just actually really good just a few um stains or what do you call it a few stains here and there nothing really major so we got a Ninong Kyle got their stroller already and it was actually good just a few ball pin stains so baby yes it's for baby kiona remember so actually what we're going to talk about today is not really it's more on the accessories of this looping stroller what to buy and what not to buy because that's what's our topic so as I've mentioned, my stroller is the Looping Squeeze 2. There's also already a 3.0, but... Um, and it has a few improvements versus the 2, but this 2 is, very, is still very nice, actually. And one of the accessories that my parents bought is this hook. This is very helpful. Actually, natanggal na yung dito sa gilid. It has a looping logo, supposedly. So, these are hooks. And it's very useful, especially for my diaper bag. Although, even without that, there's already a, what do you call this? A hook for bags in the on the sides of the handle of the stroller. There. So, another upgrade that my parents bought is the wheels. This is the bigger set of wheels for the stroller. And 
Actually, my mom doesn't know why we upgraded. It's my dad who wanted to upgrade, but it's a bigger wheel compared to the original wheels that this comes in. So, I guess if you have any knowledge about wheels, you'll know why. <laughs> and one more thing that we bought for this stroller is... Tasha, where's the cup holder? Where did you put it? Okay, just a second. We'll look for the cup holder. So guys, this is the cup holder, the looping cup holder. And we don't recommend that you buy this. We It's very hard to use and it's not sturdy at all. So don't buy that. You know what's even better? What my mom does when she buys milk tea before before the pandemic and I'm in the stroller. She just uses this small bag. Okay, I'll show you later. Okay, so my mom would use this small bag. This small bag. It's actually has a brand on it. Favorite milk tea. And put her milk tea inside. And you know what she does? She just hooks it up here. Or sometimes, can I borrow baby? Sometimes she would hook it up here on the side. So there. Yes. Oh, okay. So that's even a better fix than the cup holder. So yeah, the cup holder is not a good buy. So there you have it, guys. My looping squeeze to stroller. What to buy, what not to buy, how much we bought it. <laughs> how long it has been with me for two years already. Yes. So that's it for today for this week guys that's our vlog for this week I hope you find it useful especially those who are thinking of buying a stroller right now Looping is a very good brand and oh one more thing when we upgraded the wheels uh, it well the stroller still folds but it's not as upright when you fold it so I'll show you. So this is the stroller when it's up, not yet folded. And this is the stroller when it's folded. As you can see, it's not upright. It's at an angle because the wheels is bigger. So, but that's just a small price to pay for bigger wheels. It's more sturdier. It's sturdier. <laughs> super, super relative, you know. So where is the vlogger? There. So that's it guys. I hope you like tonight's vlog and you find it useful. So please like my videos and subscribe to my channel and click here. Where do they click baby? You're busy. So guys. Please like my video and subscribe to my channel and click here. But I'm busy. So please just click here in my kili kili. And till next week, guys. Bye. Say bye, Tash. Wave your hand. Babes. <laughs>